The first letter, Proscorintius, chapter 6. Is any of you daring, having a matter against another, to be being judged before the unrighteous ones, and not before the holy ones? Or have ye known not that the holy ones shall judge the world? And if the world is being judged by you, are ye being unworthy ones to judge the smallest matters? Have ye known not that we shall judge messengers? How much more things of this life? If therefore ye should be having to judge things of this life, are ye seating these ones, who are the ones having been utterly disesteemed by the assembly, to judge? I am saying this to move you toward shame. Thus not one among you, no one a wise man, is being able to decide a dispute in the midst of his brothers. But brother is being judged with brother, and this before unbelievers. Already indeed therefore altogether a failure is being in you, that ye are having lawsuits with each other. Why not rather be being wronged? Why not rather be being defrauded? But ye, ye are doing wrong. And ye are defrauding, and this ye do to brothers. Or have ye known not that unrighteous ones shall not inherit God's kingdom? Don't be deceiving yourselves. Neither sexual sinners, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate ones, nor male bedding men nor thieves, nor covetous ones, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor extortioners, shall inherit God's kingdom. And some of you were being such things, but ye washed yourselves, but ye became sanctified, but ye became righteous by means of the name of the Lord Yeshua anointed, and by means of the Spirit of our God. All things are being lawful for me, a lawless person might falsely claim, but not all things are being helpful. All things are being lawful for me, a lawless person might falsely claim, but I will not be mastered under anything. The foods are for the belly, and the belly is for the foods. A sexual sinner might reason from. But the God shall bring to naught both this belly and those foods. But the body is not for the sexual sin, but for the Lord, and the Lord for the body. And the God both raised the Lord, and will raise out us through his power. Have ye known not that your bodies are being members of anointed? Having taken therefore the members of the anointed, should I make them members of a harlot? Khalila, not so. Or have ye known not that the one being joined to the harlot is being one body? For the twain, he is saying, shall become into one flesh. But the one being joined to the Lord is being one spirit. Be ye fleeing the sexual sin, every sin which a man might do is being outside the body. The one committing sexual sin is sinning into his own body. Or have ye known not 
that your body is being a temple of the Holy Spirit in you, of which ye are having from God. And ye are being not your own, for ye were bought for a value. Glorify ye the God, therefore, by means of your body.